Hey folks, Quill18 here. Uh, just a quick update on the Civ situation. Uh, some of you may or may not have seen my post, but the Civ 4 Rise of Mankind uh, game is definitely dead. I've asked for advice on the Civ Fanatic forums, and I actually got um, replied to by one of the developers of Rise of Mankind and New Dawn, um, letting me know that there are specific bugs in that version of the game that I, I was using. Um, because apparently just Rise of Mankind by itself is actually defunct, and I didn't know that. And this guy, Aphoros, is uh, the developer of Rise of Mankind, A New Dawn, which has sort of taken over, and is quite a bit more developed. Um, so in a conversation with him, I said, okay, well, I'll just use this, that, that sounds pretty good. And he actually suggested, because um, the, the latest one is 1.75 with with the patch, and he suggested the beta builds are, are better. The beta build of 1.76 is more stable and better, but wait for 1.76e this weekend. He's been actively working on it, and he's, he's, developed, he's, he's releasing a, a finalized version of the beta, I believe. Um, however, it hasn't been released yet, and my plan was I was going to do a marathon like 48 hours. Well, okay, I was going to sleep in between, but Saturday and Sunday I was going to do nothing but play Civ 4. Uh, Rise of Mankind and New Dawn and record it and make a Let's Play. But um, I, I don't know when this is going to be released. For all I know, it'll be Sunday night, and then I won't really have a tremendous amount of time to, to get anything done. Um, so I, I'm going to see. I'm going to... I, I really, really, really intended to get some Civ 4 up this weekend, but we may not be able to because I want to make sure that we're not playing a buggy, crashy version, obviously, because that would be the worst thing ever. Um, so stay tuned. I do have a bunch of p content planned this weekend as an alternative if Civ 4 doesn't come through, but I just want to let you guys know.